Hey everybody, Jamie here, Nomadic Rev. Welcome back to another uh, video here on my YouTube channel. And I wanna talk about what's happening with the gas shortage of 2021. Uh, we've been hearing a lot of uh, news stories leading up to now that this might be possible basically because of a truck driver shortage. So if you go back and do a Google search, even a couple months ago, uh, news organizations and outlets were reporting about gas outage um, this summer. And then I don't know how many of you are aware of this, but I got wind today that parts of Northern Florida, there was uh, no gas to be had in any gas stations down there. So it turns out that on Friday, there was a cyber attack on the Colonial Pipeline and um, it impacted not only the supply of gas in the Southeast, well, actually it's all the way from the East Coast down all the way to Texas because they shut the pipeline down completely on Friday. And so now a couple of few days later, it's starting to have an impact in certain parts of the country. Um, parts of the country that are being affected by this are Georgia, Tennessee, South Carolina, North Carolina, Virginia, Mississippi, and Alabama. And again, uh, parts of Northern Florida and uh, so these markets are served by the Colonial Pipeline, uh, one of the nation's most critical pipelines for refined oil products. Uh, one of the things that, I, uh, the other things that I was hearing on social media today is that even if people weren't finding gas shortage uh, or unable to find gas, that prices had spiked as much as 50 cents per gallon, uh, depending on where you were in the country. And so even if you are still able to get gas in some of these states, it sounds like prices are gonna increase dramatically over the next few days. And so um, I was actually looking at the Facebook page for Gas Buddy. Maybe a lot of you use Gas Buddy as an app on your phone to track uh, the lowest prices of gas when you're traveling. Um, but they're also asking people to use the app to report outages that they come across. And so if you are one of those people in one of those states and you come across a shortage, they're asking you to use the app uh, to report it. It sounds like uh, the longer the problem continues, um, the more it will affect the states that I listed there. Um, and even once the pipeline restarts, it will take days for it to be back to normal, if not weeks. And so the problem is, is that what, what happened with COVID and toilet paper, how many of you remember that, is, is likely or could happen with the gas shortage in the Southeast. And so they're asking uh, people, gasbuddy.com, they're asking people um, not to hoard gas, avoid, they actually say avoid filling up your tank until the pipeline um, is back up. But as you can imagine, the opposite is happening. You can just do a search in the Facebook uh, search bar and you'll find videos and pictures of people sharing, um, looking for gas basically in these states. And so um, it's hard to imagine that this won't have a ripple effect on the rest of the country given some of the other conditions that people talked about as well. So if you are in one of these states and you're being affected by this, please leave a comment below because it would be beneficial for the YouTube community. Uh, that's what we're here for, um, to really be a resource to one another and figure out exactly what's happening and, and who's being affected where. Again, my name is Jamie. Uh, my channel is all about the nomadic living lifestyle, digital nomad. Uh, I have a camper van that I'm coming to you now from. So uh, if you like videos like this, be sure to subscribe hit the like button, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this video uh, as well as where you're watching from. Have a great night.